so we get spice in front of us and there's no way we can jump over or use any of our character's abilities to get past it so even though there is a warning sign over there i guess we can do it we can't do anything but pull these levers and wait for the a miracle to happen, one of Just because you can pull a lever doesn't mean you should. Our intrepid trio may not give this kind of seismic meddling a second thought, but choices have consequences. I've played host to more truth seekers than any human would care to count, and I know an omen when I see it. <laughs> Trust me, this is ominous. Ominous? Ominous. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ominous. Uh, oh, never mind. That's how I feel when I can't pronounce a word correctly. Still, the problem is that we didn't have a choice there. And I thought this game is going to do this to us a couple more times. Force us to do something. Because we, we, otherwise we can't progress. And then mock us for doing that. That's not cool. Who are you? Hello was there. Was it you that caused that cave-in? Nope. I know it That's was. Bucket, now my three mine cars is trapped in these caverns and caves. You'll bring Ooh. those mine cars back if you know what's good for you. Maybe this dynamite will convince Corn. you. I need all three of those mine Yikes. cars back, you hear? <laughs> <laughs> I got plenty more dynamite where this came from. So, <laughs> that guy is now mad because... How am I supposed to bust through by, those caves? Uh, give me the bucket. Yeah. Oh, crap. I need my stuff. Bring me my stuff, I need Nigga it. is mad because it's mine cars. Who are you anyway? Are... No, 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 Oh, I didn't want to drop it. I wanted to pick up some water. Are stuck behind uh, uh, rocks. There's been cave-ins everywhere because of us pulling levers, which caused uh, some sort of earthquake for whatever reason. So yeah, there is a whole bunch of uh, rubble covering the way, trapping the minecarts somewhere. And uh, so, why? The reason why he's not using all the dynamite to get the, the mine cards is beyond me. <laughs> and that makes me really dislike that character. He's just a jerk. Dead he's going to. He's so incoherent. Like, he's telling us that we should fix what we have done, which I, I can kind of understand, but at the same time he's trying to kill us, so he's like uh, go get the minecart minecarts back and then he tries to blow us up, and that's not cool so we use the water bucket to get the mine, the dynamite <laughs> it still works even though it's supposed to be wet and stuff, but uh, we get through which is something that the miner could have done easily completely by himself, maybe he wouldn't have been able to solve the puzzle that is here so for whatever the old reason, miner's a, instincts a were right. Here, but, uh, there is a mine car trap back yeah, it here. I could have just come he here. Have overreacted own. a bit, but at a certain age, you've got to do something that gets you up in the morning. Even if what gets you up in the morning is a dangerous lack of interpersonal skills and anger management issues. Well, I'll use this excuse when I'm old. Let's uh, see. <laughs> the night, uh, just uh, going through a forest uh, during the night. Uh, and completely ignoring the poor noble being robbed. So what does this lever do? Gold! It picks up gold and then it drops it. Stupid machine. So what we get to do is to push the minecart to the left uh, where the exit is but for some reason... Well I guess it's unnecessary. I, I need to get people here. I'm stuck! Ah, um. I can't get down. Wonderful, my characters are stuck. <sighs> Let's get the knife to help. Mm. Get a bit of a slow down here. So yeah, that guy, I dislike him. What we gotta do if we want to keep going is to help him out with, with his little problem. We need to get the twins up here. What happens is that the minecart can't get past this barrier. Thing called Sniff. Sniff. 
and uh, to fix that problem we've got to have pretty decent timing and make the minecart way heavier so how about this um actually i'm not sure if you're supposed to solve it like this we can just uh, get uh, the minecart stuck there against the weight of the knight and then drop the gold in the minecart but i think what uh, really what it really wanted us to do was to drop it from here and have a good timing with the pulling of the levers uh, so that as the minecart goes down uh, the gold will be dropped in it I, th I think it was the point uh, and i'm not sure if i was supposed to be able to do that by just uh, stopping the minecart there with another character there it My is gold. i thought you was gone for good time to get down to some serious hoarding Making golden apples. Let's get back. We need to do this business with the dynamite <laughs> two more times. There's three minecarts we need to get. And we need to blow up a bunch of things. Luckily, we don't need to fill the water every the bucket every time, at the least. <laughs> uh, that would get annoying. But yes, there's a, a lot of coming here, getting back up, and then coming again. back here. And that gets annoying. Cars. Boop! Okay, I will tell also, you give me my three mine to save woo woo to save up time, actually to save up time, I'm going to leave the postcard just momentarily somewhere around here. Actually, the minecarts are going to go through here. I hope it's not an issue if there's a, if, the, if they run. <laughs> I know you caused that oh, no, now wait. you've got to make it good. If they run over the postcard, they could so ruin it. We need a shovel back. later. We don't need the D. I'll trade you can. all the stick of this dynamite if you bring back all three Shut mine up. cars. Hell, I'll trade all my dynamite. The first time I went through this, I thought that it was what I was supposed to do to get him to give me the dynamite. And I spent so long just trying to figure out uh, how to make him give me the dynamite until I uh, eventually realized I was supposed to grab it uh, with uh, the bucket f filled with water. And that's a tiny bit silly. These characters, that's a problem with... Uh, with the silent uh, characters, we <laughs> if they had a tiny bit more communication skills, uh, that would solve all of their problems. There's another flame we can use, drop this here. I totally don't need to drop it, you know, if I die, it's not permanent. But I, I really don't get why that guy tries to murder us while at the same time asking us to help him. It just doesn't make a tiny bit of sense. Whoops! I didn't want to, I just wanted to drop from the ladder. Can I do that? Okay, good. Oop, we got, we got another time traveler's uh, portrait. Greatest employee of all time. Not him. Apparently, somebody we didn't like uh, has become the greatest employee of all time, which is uh, quite impressive, I must say. So, there's uh, our minecart down there. These platforms, uh, move with weight and this is the exit this is where the minecart uh, is supposed to go so we need to do this uh, very simple weight puzzle to bring the minecart where we need it so let's get the time traveler uh i don't remember if we need all three jump <laughs> if we need all three characters for this I, I believe we do actually so the knight is going to keep that there we move the minecart to the left and the knight is smart enough to not be in the way of the minecart. Ah, it's so difficult to drop from these letters. Ah. Now we can bring the minecart up if I go here and the knight moves out of the way. Wonderful, but now we can't push the minecart. So yeah, we need someone else over there. <laughs> Ah, uh, I need I need a summon spell. I need some magic to summon the twins. I I understand why there is no option to automatically bring uh, all the other characters to the character you're controlling, because otherwise you'd break a lot of puzzles by moving characters around when you're not supposed to. But it still gets really annoying to move uh, all these heroes. Heroes? They're not heroes at all, but that's how, what I call them. It's really annoying to move them around the entire time, around all the levels, which get bigger and bigger as you progress through the game. There's the minecart. And now we need to... We need to move. Uh, I guess I need 
Why didn't I can do that? Like this. And yes, I need a third character. Whoops, to push the minecart over there. And finally. Ah ah. Hey, Tully. I could have pushed the minecart all the way here at the very beginning of this. Hmm. I am silly. Uh, oh, you can die by getting crushed. Oops. Oh, and that gave me a shortcut to get in the, to the minecart. Wonderful! I wish I could say I had planned it, but uh, I haven't. I didn't know that was possible. There we go, I made this. Oh, whoa, whoa, why didn't you keep pushing it? Oh, uh, uh, huh. So overly complicated. Working uh, in a 2D like environment, even if visually it's uh, 3D, gets uh, silly sometimes. My vittles! Feller can build up a powerful hunger down here. I'm gonna roast me up some canaries. Now, see here, I canaries? still need me my last minecar, Dagnabbit. Dagnabbit. I like that. I'm gonna start using it. <laughs> we left. Why is it so difficult to. For me today to get down from letters, I don't know. Uh, they, the maybe they cover the letters in glue, and I have issues getting my hands away. <laughs> we need to auto die, get one more dynamite, and then we're finally set. Uh, there's the boss card. Let's the time see in a that it's still alive and well. Back, and that time is now. Okay. Let's get up. Uh, we also need uh, the other two characters for this one. Uh, I take it back. We only need two. Wonderful. I'll use the time traveler because the time traveler has the shovel, which we need. That's why I picked it up earlier. That uh, saved me one extra trip. It's really, it's a really one. I mean, puzzle games in general are uh, they last uh, a long while when you play. It through, when you play through them for the first time and after that if you play through them again it takes like five minutes for what you accomplished in days the first time now where the, the fire is here oops but this one even more oh, 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 oh. <laughs> i saved the bucket i'm a hero this one is easy to quote unquote break even though as i mentioned oh, oh, oh it's up here um the developers almost encourage you to try to break it as much as possible. So we played a, a prank on our dad and we're pretty happy about it. Oh, there was a bat up there, did you see that? Aww, how cute. Also, I killed myself. Ourselves? Ooh, I bet the twins, if they, if they spoke, if they weren't, if they weren't uh, silent, uh, protagonists they would totally complete each other's sentences either that or speak exactly at the same time and say exactly the same words with the same tone that's because because they are that adorable ah, still having issues getting off letters <laughs> it's okay i can do it i can climb the rope I like how every I already mentioned that I love the animations in this game, but the, the, just the, they have uh, different animations even when they're climbing on things while holding objects or just uh, walking or doing whatever while holding objects. That's nice, except for the letter. As you can see, the shovel goes uh, through the letter. Uh, the problem with something well made is that you notice uh, when there's one small flaw somewhere. So. <laughs> The first time I sent a minecart this way, I saw it going, heard the sounds, waited for the cutscene to start and it never did, so I went back and, I, and the minecart came through here. I started laughing like crazy because I was not expecting it to come back. And then it took me a long while to realize that I was supposed to focus on the character inside of the minecart to accomplish something. Now we see where the minecart is going. Unlike the previous minecarts where we could still see where they were going without the need of having a character in there, so... 
I don't know. So this, whoever built this trail is a moron. Because <laughs> it gets backwards, but luckily we can change where the minecart will end up. There we go, because we've got a shovel. And with the shovel we can smack people in the face. That is my lifetime Nye! objective. Three, that was barely in time. We broke something on our way here, podcast. Here it is, my special empty mine car. A miner can't have enough empty mine cars. Oh, look at that. Those mine cars meant the world to that old guy. Maybe a reward is in order, hmm? Reward! More dynamite? <laughs> Let's go. We, there is a certain theme in this game. I don't know if you already noticed about um, breaking bridges. <laughs> oh hell! My gold! Come back gold! I would worry more about the food. The miner wasn't such a bad guy. He was down here a long time, and that'll take its toll. Obtaining the thing you desire most isn't always as hard as it's made out to be, but it will change you. And that, my friends, is what's hard. I appreciate the lesson here, but I don't see how that applies to the miner. It doesn't, uh, didn't uh, obtain what he desired most, kind of. Well, we brought it to him. So, uh, I'm not really sure where I'm supposed to go. This is the adventurer's level. Oh yeah, we're forced to go through that. So it, it's going, the door is going to open for us. And let us through, only ah, there we go, see only the adventurer can get there because she has a thing that allows her to cross gaps. 